How you guys doing? No fat day one of ninety. And real quick, just got the way. Yes, I relapsed yesterday. And well, real, real quick, just just to just to go to get right into it. Those um that last no fat streak, but like, it didn't. I think it's, well, I'm not making any excuses, but that last no fat streak, it little it, it didn't really it didn't even it felt like I was just I don't know it felt weird like it felt like I was it felt. I feel like I wasn't even, I wasn't even thinking about no fat, not in a good way, like, like, it seemed like I was just doing everything completely wrong, you know, you know, just, I, I, don't, I don't know, it just, it just felt weird, like, you know, and, and, you know, typically after, a, after I'll go on like a, you know, 10 plus day streak, something like that, and when I relapse initially, a few days later, I'll always end up relapsing again for some reason, unfortunately, I thought it was going to be different, but it just felt weird, like, you know, it just this last week felt I didn't feel like I was doing no fat, you know. And then yesterday I just I was just like, you know what? It it wasn't even it was just like a quick giving, like I wasn't even it was like it's like I wasn't even motivated to not to like not give into an urge which wasn't that strong. I just feel like it just seems like whenever you go on a long streak with well, me and I end up relapsing, I'll, it's always it's always a, maybe a few days later that I, end up, I always end up relapsing yet again, and then the next three after that is when I go longer, I'm gonna do a long one. It's, it's, it, I mean, I'm not proud of that, but I mean, you can't really change the, the past. But to talk about today, like um, if it like I I would leave like four times yesterday, yesterday evening, and um, uh, it probably it probably felt weird because like I, I relapsed. Um, on my my um my my last week I relapsed. It was like two it was like two two p.m. in the afternoon that I relapsed. So twenty four hours from two p.m. You know it's it's, it's kind of weird if you. Uh, I mean if I if, if I stop my if I stop my new no fast week after two p.m. That means from like two to ten o'clock. That's like that's like six hours. So say I go to sleep at like at like eleven, I wake back up at eight and then. Start my day and then then um start my day. Say I get up at like six. Um, how many hours? How many hours? Six a.m. to like two p.m. That's not like it's that's not that long. So it's like um, the days seem kind of weird. When typically I would, when I would relapse, I would say you know fuck it, I'm gonna wait till like ten, eleven, twelve o'clock. I'm gonna relapse. I'm gonna get one out, one last one out. So then you know I can wake up the next day and say okay, this is the next new first day. When 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 the clock strikes eleven fifty nine or twelve o'clock. That a new day would be completed. Maybe that's just, that's just my OCD. But anyway, it just felt weird. It, and then you know, just felt like a weird streak. You know, um, I was I, I probably part because I was also eating fast food way too much. You know, when you work late, it's like when you work late or when you work longer hours, it's like effort. I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a <laughs> this this whopper real quick and a medium fry along with a um root beer. It, that's not healthy to eat, eat fast food like that, you know, a few days in a row. Plus, I just felt completely out of it. But, um, yes, like I was saying, um, I released like four times yesterday, and then, I, like, I knew the next day, you know, on campus at school, I, like, I just, and I even just at school, I just felt like overall, I just felt like I wasn't even human. Not in a good way either. <laughs> like, um, I would say my hair was hurting, but I couldn't think straight, you know. Wasn't focused, like, cause it's, it's once you once you, if you relapse if you really, if you relapse one time on no fab if you if you relapse one time on no fab if you relapse one time on no fab you good you may be good okay you relapse okay cool okay cool but you can you can still function you relapse twice uh, you you okay still if you go if you if you go on a twelve day streak a twelve day streak or whatever or or a nice high streak and you relapse twice it's not gonna really affect you that much. Three times, okay. Now you're pushing. You just stop there. Four times, it's like okay, okay. Now you just and now you fuck yourself up. So pretty much, I really like four times and spend like how many hours, like two, three hours. And like afterwards, I felt like I was like losing. That that's how you know that the um that the um when people when when they say that sexual energy is the most powerful energy on the planet, that's definitely true because I didn't I could, I felt like I was I couldn't function today, you know, and and and, and not in society, you know. When you you notice that when you release your semen a lot, you 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 start to get get like minor colds, your nose and stuff, you know things like not not serious, but you know my nose was stuffy, not stuffy, but I was you know it's a minor cold, you know. It's, I guess because you know you you release your energy, 
inside your life force inside you and then you start your body starts to deteriorate you um start to lose your energy from each of your um i don't know if you guys believe in chakras but um hey um i guess you start to deplete all of them and so all your chakras so so you start to become like weaker spiritually and physically because it it, it, uh, it does have physical effects and then i just i just couldn't, couldn't focus straight it makes you 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 get very ir irritated very quickly when you when you just when you recently relapse as well and or binge so that's that, that that's definitely i mean that factor thing is n no joke but actually i feel i feel much better now though i don't know i don't know why after i go on a long streak i just can't hop get back on the horse and then do another one it has i, I go a few days and then bam back back again and then i'm good to go the long streak to go on a longer streak it's weird but um definitely definitely after I, whenever i relapse like that always the next day is always you know the anxiety occurs the all all the insecurities pop back everything just come everything is every all the negative things about yourself or that you think about yourself they just get they just get bigger and it's raining it's raining like hell outside too so yeah, but when I, when I was on day twelve, day thirteen, all the pop, I don't see all, but you know, felt much better. Then OCD wasn't as bad, you know, insecurity wasn't as bad. Everything was pretty, everything was good. Everything was improving pretty, pretty great. As soon as that nut was released, bam. But I'm gonna read you guys a comment from the last video real quick. I know I was gonna say I was gonna read it from the past two videos, but um, it's too it's, it's no point of it's reading the comments from like the day two video because <laughs> that's a lot. That's like it's I guess it's too late for that, but um, I can start from here. Um, um, Jewish forty seven, haha. I didn't know you had social anxiety. That's one of the reasons I'm on no fat to beat the, the, that anxiety on day seven. Good luck. Um, typically it's like not it's not like an extreme version of social anxiety where like I can't I can't I can't I just can't even fathom. Woo, that thunder was loud. Y'all heard that? Woo! Wait a minute. Make, let me make sure this. Woo! That was a that was a big thunderstorm. Or a big thunder shock or whatever you guys want to call it. Just saying Pokemon. Whatever. <laughs> but but it's not like a stream level of social anxiety where I just can't function in society. I just like literally walking with my head down, not, not able to just talk to or look at anybody. It's that on, on a scale of one to ten, after I just fab, it's like a seven and a half. But if I'm on a nice, if I'm on a, okay, like a 14 day streak, something like that, I wish I need to get back to 14 days. It's been a long, it's been like two, three months I've been, since I even got to 14 days. But, um, you know, I, I, I don't, I don't, feel, I don't, I'm not as anxious, you know, I can look people in the eye, some sort of, like, especially the young ladies, you know, you just feel all, all the way better about yourself. But when you're fapping, you you can't look. You can barely you can barely function. Cause you don't care about eating healthy or whatever because like I don't give a damn. You know it's very hard with me anyway. It's very hard to say okay, let's get back to this working job thing. Let's eat better because you, you don't have the motivation to do it. That, that may not be an excuse, but this fat fapping definitely you know it definitely just you know it, it definitely messes up your motivation to do other things. And then no point challenge. Is this your is your goal? Your, is your top your is your top goal not just ninety days without masturbation or exhaustion? Not being porn for ninety days, and after that, do you plan on completely stopping watching porn? My videos will help you even if they are short and sweet. I guess you are using a tablet or an iPhone. I'm using a Kodak LOL. Can afford a camera or webcam or a tablet. And then he said uh, he replied to his own comment. I'd like to learn more about you so I can give you better su supports. Um. My goal is ninety days without masturbation and porn. Um, it's no if, if you're gonna go ninety days without masturbation, you might well without porn or either or you might as well cut the other out because let's be real, who who can if you can go ninety days without porn, you completely cured your brain and you have and you have the free reign to masturbate maybe once or twice a week now without porn of course or visual stimuli. Um, that's not gonna be too fun, actually. I mean, who? I can't even fathom masturbating without watch some sort of visual stimuli. I, I mean, it's like I might as well just quit it. I, it's, I, it's not. I'm not gonna enjoy last. I'm not gonna be in, in the point to it. So um, yeah, I'm trying to do both, and um, because why not? I mean, getting rid of one or the other can you know? If you just quit, if you if you quit watching porn and you say okay, I'm just gonna masturbate once or twice a week now. If you release that one time, and may, you may get the the taste effect may be real. You may be like. Hmm. 
fuck this, I'm watching porn. It can be just that quick because so if you're gonna quit porn, watching porn or quit masturbating, you might as well do quit doing the other as well. Um and yes, I compare I plan on completely stop completely stop completely to stop watching porn. <laughs> Unless somebody just shoves their phone in my face or something like that or the T V just changes to a porn station and I just watch it, you know, on accident. But that's probably that's <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> But no, after that, I'm, I'm gonna try my try my best. I'm gonna if I if I make it to ninety days, chances are highly that I'm probably not gonna have an urge to even view porn. And if and if an urge does show up, it's gonna be very small. Where I can just immediately dismiss it. Um, you seem very nervous in the video. Uh, this is again no porn challenge. You seem very nervous in the video. You should do meditating. Many good videos you got to check out to help you. Also, you should. Think small. I mean, instead of thinking ninety days, think seven days. Then when you are done with that, that with that, think one month. Because in your head, you're thinking ninety days, which is a lot for someone who watches porn and jerks off every day. And start the K9 web web protection program. So when you feel the urge to search porn, it won't let you. If you need help, online supports. Let me know. Well, I I, I don't I don't I don't typically when I <laughs> when I do my fapping. <laughs> Um, I don't I don't use the computer, so um, it's usually a phone or a tablet. Hmm. There you go. So I mean, I, I don't know if you can if you can install a K9 filter on the phone or a tablet, but um, even then, you know, you can still if you you have to have a password and you know you can still find ways to get you, you can still find ways to get past it. So yeah, and then, then you said take it like seven days. I think I um definitely that's my biggest problem is after I relapse, I start to like look for it like if I if I relapse on day 12 I start to look for I start, I start to count for it 12 days and mark the date in the calendar then you know okay when I get back to this day then I'll be good so, but doing that it's like you just you, you you're wasting your, your your life away just kind of obsessing over no fab and getting back to this day so you're right I'm, I, instead of taking seven days I'm probably just gonna start taking it one day at a time just take it one day at a time that way if you focus on one day at a time, before you know it, you'll be here, then you'll be here, then you'll be there, there. But, um, you know, you're definitely right about that. Then, New Day, what do you think you'll do after completing 90 days? Actually, I have no clue because <laughs> I haven't been close to 90 days, but I'm sure from 90 days, 90 days from now, I'll be a completely different person. I'll be, now I have a completely different mind. So... Who knows? I can't say what I what I do after that, um, because I can pretty much guarantee you, if I ninety days from now, I'll be a completely different person. I'll be thinking completely differently. <laughs> so I can't give you ask me ask me that question again on day sixty <laughs> or day thirty at least. And then Eddie, sorry. Okay, bro. On this attempt, you gotta smash your personal record. Rec record. Trust me, you got this. Hmm. You know how you said this was this was in a no fap day three video. Yep, yep. No, no. Give me. <laughs> you said on this attempt. Yeah, yeah. I meant this one. This is what I mean. I meant this attempt. I'm good on this attempt. It's my. It's my. It's my last attempt. It's my um. It's the. It's my attempt that I get to ninety days. This is the one. <laughs> so yeah, on this attempt, I will. I will smash my personal record, and then not just that, but get past it, and then George forty seven relapse with a question mark. You already know I relapsed because, you know, I didn't get kidnapped or I didn't get just killed or anything like that. So if I, if I don't have a video that, that the previous night, I'm, it means I relapsed. But um, it just feels good to get past one day. But I mean, I mean, it, it, it it's, it's also it's a it's a funny process how your brain will. It's a funny process how you'll feel, how you know that when if you relapse, what what will happen? But you still do it anyway because your brain wants that one and a half seconds of orgasm. And not just the orgasm, but the whole process of searching for the for the porn, or whatever your brain considers porn. Um, the whole process of you know looking at pictures, uh, the whole nine yards, whatever you use to to fab to, your brain wants that as well as the orgasm. So it's funny how you know if you do this, what's going to happen the next day. You're not you're going to be a, a pretty much a zombie. You're not going to feel like a human, but you still do it anyway. Then you realize afterwards, why did I just do that? The worst time ever. What just happened to me when you when you when you relapse off of a street and then a few days later you you, you relapse again. That's what really that that really messes you up. Because all those 
all those releases within those few days it kind of like really destroys your body so um yeah it def definitely was a definitely was a long day today um when I, when I was on 13 days i was able to, to cope with different things but today i was in my i was in my free cow class i was getting you know just flustered got the mad palms up there that's that's a bad mix a no fat relapse with with trigger with pre calculus whoo that would get you frustrated so i was getting first i was like i just had to i gotta get out of this class and get, the, and get just get a breather i just need to get a breather you know i just felt felt congested in the class that's what didn't feel didn't feel help didn't feel good at all you know actually i don't, I don't even have motivation to even work out right now but um Boy, when I get to that, when I get to like day seven or eight, it's like it's it's it just. I just think it's funny how no fap is like it's bigger than what, what, what we think it is. You, it's not just a placebo effect, and you know, it's definitely real because you just you can do so much when you get to a nice little short.